I have my uncle's comic book collection. He passed away, and this was handed down to me. And they're all comic books? All comic books. This is pretty cool. Is there anything good in here? I have no idea. All right, how many boxes do we have here? I have seven. This is actually only half of his collection. My brother inherited the other half. Well, hopefully you got the good half. I hope so. <laughs> I'm at the pawn shop, because where else are you going to take seven boxes of comic books and sell them? I'm hoping that they're really valuable, but I don't have the time to go through them all. If I sell the comic books, I'm probably going to spend the money taking my kids on vacation. OK, there's some pretty cool stuff in here. Dracula, I know you've heard of Dracula. Lord of the Vampires. <laughs> The Avengers are so hot right now. They have so many movies. I think this is the first one that Rogue made an appearance in. It's pretty cool. It looks like a bunch of paper to me. What do you mean, bro? Have you ever heard of Doctor Strange? No, but I'm looking at Strange. Well, Doctor Strange could be worth a few hundred bucks on its own. I wonder what else you got in here. Oh, the X-Force. Issue two. This is like one of the first couple times Deadpool made his appearance in a comic book. So you acting like you're an expert in this. Whatever, bro. You better get somebody down here that knows what they're talking about. Dude, I don't need Paul. These are comic books. He's a comic book expert? I may not know everything about comic books, but these comics are priced between a quarter and 75 cents per book, which means I can date them back to the 70s or 80s, which means they're from the Bronze Age of comics, and bronze is only two steps away from gold. And there's seven boxes of these babies. Sometimes you can just fill the deal. Enough of negative Nancy over there. I think you have a pretty cool collection. What exactly are you looking to get for him? I'd like to get $2,000. Well, I can tell you that ain't gonna happen. Even if there's $2,000 worth of comics here, it's gonna take a lot of time to go through all these boxes. Um, I'm gonna have to find that diamond in the rough. But with that being said, you know, pretty sure I can. I'll give you 50 bucks a box, that's 350. Can you do 500? Um, would you go 450 on them? 500 is going to be the lowest I can go. I don't know. What do you think? I don't want no parts of this if you don't call Paul down here. Life is about chances, and sometimes you just got to take them. I'm going to do the 500. I'm going to show everyone what an expert I really am. I know there's going to be some good stuff in here. Meet you right over there to write it up. Thank you. I'm taking the $500 because I don't want to carry the comic books out of here. This is how you do it, Antoine. This is how you make a name for yourself in this business. When these are going to be worth five grand, I'm going to be the one who gets the reward. What did you two buy? I didn't buy anything. Leave it up to your expert. I bought these comics for 500 bucks. When did you become an expert on comic books? I only worked at the pawn shop for almost 15 years. So just do me a favor and do call someone who knows something about comic books and find out if I just lost money. Yeah, like Paul. Watch. You just watch. All right, guys. Here's Paul. <laughs> All right. Hey, that's a nice little stack we got there. Yeah. Um, I pulled about 18 books. Um, some really cool stuff. Yeah, duh. Uh, you got First Taskmaster, First Nova, Red Hulk. Some good stuff. There's Doctor Strange in there. Yep. I said it pretty good. Um, All right, the big question, what are they worth? Uh, this stack I pulled is probably, you know, there's about 200 bucks retail. And the other couple hundred pounds of comic books are worth? Uh, about five cents a book, if you're lucky. It's like, it's common stuff. There's nothing high grade, nothing that's really worth getting certified. How many of them are there? 300 in a box, so 2,100. 2,100 nickels. I'm not good at math, but it seems like it's more than 500. If you spent 500 bucks on some comic books, I'll be lucky to get like 180 bucks out of, and seven boxes of the recyclable paper. So they're basically worthless. No, they're not worthless. <sighs> thanks for stopping by, man. Anytime. Appreciate it. All right. Take care. Thanks for the bad news. Mr. Brown and I got along famously. <laughs> Why he tittled through a pass? I caught the ball myself. It's got a name engraved on it. How did you end up with this? Sounds so fun.